Hello all, it is Happy Summer and welcome to a brand new Sims 3 Let's Play. I am so excited to be introducing you to this. I have spent a little while coming up with this story and as you can see this is part one of Let's Play Corbin's Life The Sims 3. I'm very excited about this. I went ahead and just, yeah, I made a backstory. Um, I'm really excited to see how this goes. I also will be taking your input in this, so if you have any suggestions, please leave them down below. But I'm going to go ahead and get into the story. So this is our Sim Corbin. So this is Corbin Noland. And Corbin Noland is a young adult. Now, his early life actually began in Bridgeport in an apartment with his single mom, Mandy. Mandy was a very hardworking mother and she did her best to take care of her precious son. She's family oriented. She absolutely loves her son um, and she loved him at the time. And even though she was such a good person at this time, her previous life was not very good. She actually, like as a teenager and like in her early 20s, she was a criminal and she actually tried to get out of it and she like moved into an apartment because like you know there's a lot of apartments in big cities especially bridgeport and she thought that, that would kind of hide her away and she was like kind of trying to run away from that past that she had but it didn't work and her past kept finding a way to put her and corbin in danger so desperate to keep her son safe she fled from the city to Isla Paradisa, or is it Isla Paradiso? I don't remember exactly. <laughs> um, and then there she was finally safe with her son, Corbin. So you're probably like, well, what happened to dad? So basically, Corbin's dad and Mandy's husband was Matt Noland. He was a really sweet man. He was actually a photographer and he met Mandy, Corbin's mom, at um, Corbin, or I'm sorry, at Mandy's best friend's wedding. He was the photographer for that wedding. Like, they hired him to do it, and they just fell in love there. But then one day, Mandy was taking care of Corbin, and at the time he was a toddler, and she actually got a phone call from the police, and they said that while Matt was taking pictures along the cliff, because he was a photographer, and he took pictures of everything. That was absolutely his dream in life. He just wanted to take pictures all the time. He loved nature. He loved being outside. And he actually, on this cliff that he was on, the gravel underneath him, you know, obviously his gravel is not very safe, but he was, like, getting a little too close to the edge, and the gravel from underneath him slipped, and, well, he slipped with that. And that was a horrible, 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 obviously, for Mandy. Corbin was too little to really understand what was going on, but that is what happened, and Mandy was just absolutely, she's like, nope. And then she actually, they ended up moving to Isla Paradiso. I'm sorry, I forgot to explain that. I didn't say that. They actually moved close after, like, everything. She's just like, hey, this just must mean I should move. So they actually moved after he passed away, too. So, like, they weren't here when he passed away, if that makes sense. So, yeah, this is Corbin. Yes, so that's where his story comes in. So, Corbin, he continued it so yeah he grew up basically like for the rest of his life in this tropical town full of life and culture and this is also where he developed his love for water and his love for music so he spends his days along the beach playing guitar and fiddling in the sun and he wants to actually be a seaside savior he wants to be a lifeguard he wants to save 50 sims he loves indie music fish and chips and aqua because it's of the ocean so he's basically kind of like a surfer i mean a modern day surfer dude you know he's just real chill real calm real just one with the ocean one with the sun one with nature kind of a guy so he loves to sim swim he loves to be he loves to sim <laughs> me um he loves to swim and he is a loner he actually didn't have any siblings growing up it was basically just him and his mom his mom wasn't a very social person just because she was always so focused on taking care of Corbin and then she or he loves Corbin loves the outdoors 
just like his dad. He got that from his dad, actually. Corbin absolutely just loves being outside. Hence why he likes to swim and why he just loves, and also partially because, you know, of how beautiful Isla Paradiso is. And then he's a virtuoso. He picked that up when he was in elementary school. He realized how much he loved to play instruments, such as the guitar. He is also eco-friendly. So that's kind of like the surfer dude, almost kind of hippie. I don't know. But he's just, you know, likes to... You know, he loves nature and he wants to take care of it. So this is his little shack thing. Yeah, this is his little shack. Um, it is super, super cute, actually. Oops, I'm going to turn on all lights. Hold on. Turn on all lights. I went ahead and furnished it, and I think it looks so cute. It is, like, so cute to me. Like, I don't know, it's very, like, beachy. This is his bedroom. Um, yeah, he just moved into it, actually. He's a young adult, so he used to, well, he, I, the house that he lived in is, hold on, where is it now? It's over here. This is the house that he used to live in. It's very, very small. His mom didn't have a lot of money. This is actually her right here, you guys. This is Mandy. Yep, she's super, super pretty, actually. Like, she is gorgeous. So he actually has his eyes, like, you can't really tell, but he has his hair color, and then his lips, and part of his nose, and he kind of has a good mixture of him and his, him and his dad and his mom, but yeah, this is Mandy, and then he has his dad's eyes, so this is his dad, his name is Matt Noland, and then that's his mom, and yeah, this is the house that they lived in again, very, very small, but it was on the ocean, and that was, like, all that mattered to him. I also have, um, a color, uh, what is it called, a shade in my game so things look really pretty that's why <laughs> um also what else was i going to say i'm gonna hit play but oh no yeah matt nolan died a long time ago he okay so basically um what was i going to say oh there's a show going on at the theater oh he loves theaters we're totally gonna go to that but yeah he also doesn't have any friends. He was really focused on school and stuff. Can we, let's go attend the concert. What else is going on? Okay. So yeah, he's going to go ahead over here. And then I also need to have him join the lifeguard career. I believe that's just under the city hall, right? Join lifeguard profession. Yeah, he's going to do that after he goes. Also, the beach is right here. So that's why I had him live over here. He really wanted to be by the beach. So this is this absolutely gorgeous beach. And this is the view. Also, my graphics in my game, oh no, what is that actually a thing? The graphics in my game are not the best, and that is only because I have been really trying to keep... He wants to get sorry, yeah, that's, that's kind of essential. Um, I don't want there to be a lot of lag, and Isla Paradiso is a huge world, and we all know there's going to be lag no matter what I do, and I have game lag no matter what I do whatever town I'm in, you know, <gasps> look at these beautiful waterfalls, guys, look at this waterfall over here, I did not know this was a thing, it's absolutely beautiful, look at this, look at that, wow, okay, that is absolutely beautiful, this concert's gonna take a little while, isn't it, oh, I want him to become friends with the pond, I probably said his name wrong, oh. I want to get rid of this portal though, tell you that I wish that we could keep I do want to go say hi so I'm gonna sell it. I want to say hi but I do not need this Hold on. Yeah. oh did the mascot leave oh wait no he's right here we put this little thing we're not going to uni we do not need to go to uni to be a lifeguard sorry definitely need to and then I'm having him keep his camera just in case we want to take pictures he's definitely not going to be a photographer but he might take pictures, you know, just because that's a thing, you know, taking pictures of things. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Anywho, Corbin, he's almost done seeing this concert, so this is actually his first concert. Let's actually, I'm sorry I'm saying that a lot. Let's see if anybody's outside. Maybe we can make some friends, because he's, like, ready. He is a loner, but, I mean, obviously anybody, everybody has some friends, you know what I'm saying? And he's also really close to his mom because of that, you know, she was a single mom. Yeah, I don't know. I don't really see anybody. Anybody over here, though? Oh, yeah, there's a couple people. There's this in here. Rosemary Collins. She actually looks pregnant. Yeah, she's pregnant. So this is Rosemary Collins. 
I don't think we're going to say hi to her. Who's this guy? This is Christopher Collins. Oh, it's the whole family. Guys, wouldn't that be cute if we were friends with the family? Okay, so this is him. Um, they look kind of old, though. I don't know if he'd be friends with the family that's old. Oh, here's a guy. He looks like a surfer dude. Rajan? Rajan Patel. <gasps> Patel? Wait, is he? Oh my goodness, what? Do you guys remember Zoe Patel? She's for sure in The Sims 4. Um, oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna go say hi to him. Again, just because I feel like he'd have some friends. And he looks like a, you know, cool, like, beachy surfer dude. So, hopefully you'll be able to say hi. What's this from? Saw great concerts. Ooh, Sims unanimously agree that experiencing a concert is, well, okay, yep. Um, is well worth the potential inner ear damage. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so we're gonna go say hi to this guy. And I'm actually really curious to see if he has a sister or not. Oh, um, no, 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 no. But we are going to get to know him though. He is our first friend, so we're definitely going to you know, just see see what his life is like a little bit, you know, and see where he went to school, if he went to school, get to know him. He's only six days older than us, cool. Yeah, very, very cute. Um, come on, are you your friend? Yeah, I just absolutely love Corbin. Like, I really fell in love with him. He just has so much personality. Usually I don't give my sins so much personality. But I feel like he just, you know, has a lot of personality. And it's going to be really kind of fun to see and explore where that goes. 21 days. Oh, I need to edit that. Okay. I need to fix that because these, okay, do not leave babies. Let's do 35 young adults and let's do 30 adults. Okay. And then elder, let's do 10. No, let's do 15. No, let's do 10. <laughs> so indecisive here. Teens are 15, child 10, toddler, let's go with 5. Okay, that's good. So yeah, he has 35 days till so he ages up. Well, I think they're going to be good friends, you guys. Show gross video, make silly face, show funny video. You know, I want them to at least be friends. And then we do need to actually find something so we can sell and buy a guitar because he does not have a guitar and i just wasn't even thinking about it oh wait look at all these plants okay hold on take back what i said i want to go fishing what i did not see you as being the fishing type i don't know why i just did not like when i thought of fishing i did not think of him being a fisher you know what i'm saying like that's what i'm saying okay we're gonna go pick these plants over here. They should give us, you know, a good amount of money at least. I also need to save my game because I definitely, it's, you know, this is, this lovely lag and freezing is because of Isla Paradiso. My game doesn't usually freeze this much. I promise. It's just because we're in this crazy world. I also went around and I tried to find, like, really nice what's what am i even thinking of really yeah i went around i had i have quite a few not quite a few but i have three custom worlds and there was one that i really wanted to move into but there actually wasn't it was more of like a a resort place like a resort world and there wasn't any places to actually live and then the other one wasn't beachy enough and i'm just like you know what i'm just not going with any of these places and then I realized that there's also Starlight Shores, and I don't think I've, like, ever, ever played Starlight Shores. But, so we could have gone in there, but at the same time, I just feel like Isla Paradiso just matches my storyline so much better. Are you guys going to be friends? I want you guys to be friends now. That's what I really want in my life, is you and Rajan to be friends. And I also want to know where he lives, because maybe he does have a sibling. I will definitely have to check that out. Just because I'm curious, like, I'm not, I'm curious for myself, not for Corbin. <laughs> I don't think Corbin definitely would not be in a relationship yet. Um, okay, so we know this guy now. Um, we should also then find out where his house is. So that's our mom. Our mom is already gone. 
from her house. Okay, so he lives over here. Los Amigos. Okay. So who actually is in here? I'm just, you know, again, just looking for myself. Just curious. I'm not actually going to do any of this. Um, oh, just, oh. Okay. Okay, there's just another guy that lives there. So maybe we could actually be friends with him. That would be kind of nice. Okay, we're not going to give a gift to your mom. Oh, although that would be cute if we gave her a flower. Eh, we might do that later. Um, what else do we have around here? Oh, these just popped up. Azaleas. Let's go pick these azaleas. And then what else is there? Any more flowers? Probably not. I don't think there are any more flowers. That's okay. We'll see what these are like. Should we give our mom a flower? Ooh, 150 million. 10 million. Black eyed Susan. Um, oh no. Okay, so we can actually afford, uh, guitar now. So that's good. But I don't know what else. Is there more flowers by him again? I mean, you're spawning. I just want another flower. Yes. Um, let's see. Yeah, I don't see anything. Come on, you wanted to, you know, find some flowers, but that's okay. Did we become friends with this guy? We did. Okay. So, yeah, we're just gonna go home now. You know, it's time. It's time to head home. He also needs to improve his charisma and athletic skills. So we definitely need to start on that. So let's definitely head home and let's get a guitar. Really excited for him. Look at his nice little, like, trail on the way home. Like, that's just so cute to me. Oh, the little taxi. How come, okay, literally, it's not even that far. Like, look at how literally not far that is. It's just like, you know what they could do? He could just want, okay, actually, never mind. This is a series of islands that would not work. I was going to be like, why couldn't you just walk around and, like, avoid the water? But then I'm like, never mind. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely going to go get this little. What are you going to consider a guitar? Why can't I think? Guys, I don't even know. Um, we're gonna get a white one, and plop them out there, and it's an acoustic guitar, I just think it's so cute. So here's our little guitar. Oh, you wanna play guitar at the park? That is so cute. Um, you know what? We can do it. We might as well get some tips as well. So let's go to, okay, what am I doing? We're gonna go back to the park. Is there a park over here, though? Like, I don't wanna have to literally go, like, does the beach count as the park? I don't know. Let's just go. We're gonna come here and then we're going to go here and play our little guitar. Does this count? I don't think it will. It does not. Okay, yeah, we need to get this athletic skill as well. So I really want him to just work on his his virtuoso skill though. Wow. He is so cute. I am honestly in love with him. Like he is just the sweetest guy. Hey, can we pick these up? I can play in the sand and play in the ocean. It is just so cute. Like, I just love this. Is anybody going to, like, come and give us some tips? Because we need the money. Is they just me? Are there, like, tons of pregnant sims? Or is that... Oh, wait, no, that's their house. Oh, God. Wait, no, it's not. What? Where are they going? These are the two people that we seen in the park. I promise we're not stalking them. I Hey, can I go underneath here? No, I can't. It's okay. Um, is there any... Oh, this guy's coming for you. Landon Porter. Or no, Lincoln. Lincoln Porter? Hi, Lincoln Porter. Who are you? Oh, he's really old and kind of creepy. Um, I don't know. I think he's creepy, but I think it's just because he's kind of... He at least looks old. Oh, who's this, guys? Gabriella Arias. Okay, hello, hello there. Um, okay, not gonna lie, we would definitely be attracted to somebody who is playing in the ocean because that is like our thing. So, we're gonna go give her a friendly introduction, like ASAP here. Okay, let's go say hi to her. Let's go see what her personality is like. Look at how cute she is, like, honestly. 
Okay, honestly though, guys, this is a loner. He would not be doing this kind of stuff. What am I even thinking of, you know? But I'm saying, like, what do you go up to people? Oh, and she thinks that we're hot. Okay. Kind of can't at the moment. We're just gonna definitely get to know her. Um, just see what she's all about. You know, I really hope that she is not married, because that would be really awkward. But we definitely think she's hot. She's only five days older than us. What else? She's unemployed. She, okay, um, oh my goodness, guys, she might be the one for us. I actually can't, oh no, she didn't like whatever we just did. We asked where her uncle Nader was, we're gonna ask if she's single. And she's single, oh my goodness, guys, this is actually hilarious, maybe we just found the one. Let me know down below if you want him to kind of... You know, before we settle on anybody, if you want him to... Oh no, it's raining. Also, can you just take a moment how and notice how they're really, like, floating on water? Wait, no, they're not really, I guess. Oops. Sorry, guys. Um... Cute. Okay, I actually can't. But yeah, let me know if you want them to, like, be a thing and, like, date already and possibly, like, have her be the one or if you want him to just kind of date around. I don't know what kind of type he'd be. I feel like he could go either way. Like, if he, he could date a bunch of people and choose on one, or or just go with the one right away. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like it could be either way. So yeah, she's she's liking us, showing her. You know, we're gonna go home now. I think. Or should they go up to eat somewhere? Is there a little? Yes, there is a little diner over here. So can we afford to eat here? Eat here with others. Eat here with Gabriella. Yeah, we can afford it. Oh, they're gonna go. Ooh, we find her 10 out of 10. Okay, guys, I actually cannot and want to be good friends with her. That's that's so cute. I honestly feel like that is so adorable. Also, oh, we took her car. Oh, she drove us. That's so sweet. Oh, I can believe we literally could have just walked. And I did not know that there was a little park over here. Did you know this? Because I did not. Oops. Oh my goodness, I keep like closing out here. Look at this adorable little beachy park. It is so cute. We're totally gonna come here and play guitar for a little while. They're so cute. I think she's so cute too, like Gabrielle. I call I think I called her Gabriella. That's okay. Gabrielle, so we already have two friends and he's a loner. That's crazy. That's so cool. Okay, yeah, they're just gonna eat here. I don't know how much it actually is. It was only 18 millions. Okay, that's not bad. Even though we're literally broke. But that's okay. Maybe we can get some tips if we play here. Play guitar. I just want him to get his skill up. Then he can go home right afterwards. He has work at 10 a.m., so technically we can sleep for a little while. Okay. Let's finish up here, buddy. He can go home afterwards. But yeah, honestly, this has been such a cute part so far, and I really hope you guys are enjoying the series because I definitely am. But I'm gonna go ahead and, yeah, end this video here. I hope you all have a joyful day. I'll be looking towards the bright side. Um... Happy summer is out.